Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Daniela and today we'll continue the last, this time, episode 18 of the third season. Uh, the last episode was about Desmond, his life before meeting Penny. Uh, he was uh, in a relation, he was about to get married, start having doubts, ask for a sign, and he ended up in a monastery. Didn't work out that well, either he got fired, but uh, that's how he ended up. Meeting Penny. Uh, on the island in the present day, he had a vision about Charlie dying, a helicopter um, woman falling from that helicopter, getting stuck in a tree, and um, Penny. So he thought that it's Penny, and he had to go along with the vision, not trying to fix anything. So he could rescue, uh, rescue her. But, you know, of course, at the end, he couldn't let Charlie die. And uh, by doing so, he thought that, you know, Penny is uh, dead. Fortunately, it wasn't Penny. And the woman is alive and she recognizes him for some reason. So, confusion. Anyway, as usual, I got... Something to drink, the episode is ready to start. So, without further ado, let's do this. I wanted to see how you were doing with your pregnancy. Oh, I'm doing fine. A little tired, but that's normal, right? Sure. Any morning sickness? Not anymore. Any bleeding? Why are you asking me all these questions, Jack? I'm just checking in. Agashimachi. <laughs> ね、まさよ。あがしあばにみ。ペッチャドンチャペ会長님まち。銀行은부잣집다님이시네。신랑이 다섯 시험에서 보지. 나올 때 달라 10만 불 준비해 갖고 와. 정말 사랑한다면 내 요구 조건을 들어줘야 진심을 감출 수 있을 걸. Oh my god. The branch. She must have hit it on the way down. Uh, get up, Pack. We haven't got much in this first aid kit. Steve, there's anything we can use in there. We have to get to Jack as soon as possible. She could be our way off the island. No, if we move it, I'll make it worse. We just let it bleed to death. Bring Jack. We, we need to bring Jack here. An eight hour walk, one way. Then I'll run. Be out of your mind. It's not safe. Nobody knows we're here. Now they know. But if it's dangerous for Desmond to go back, it's dangerous for them to move her as well. So. Why? Dangsin 가족 사진은 하나도 없어요. 내가 어렸을 때 우리 집에는 카메라가 없었어. 한 장도 없다고? 그래도 아버님 유품이나 편지 한 장도 없다고? 아버지 내가 군대에 있을 때 돌아가셨어. 당신이 열여섯 살때 아버님이 돌아가셨다고 하지 않았어요? 아니 무슨 소리야? 군대에 있을 때 돌아가셨다니까? 아니 지난번에 당신이 당신이 잘못 들었겠지. What if the others want my baby? He's been there alone for over a week. How do we know he isn't working with them? He's not working with them. It's Juliet. She was their doctor, their their fertility doctor, studying pregnant women and. When Claire was sick, she told me and Jack the reason the others wanted her baby was for research. You're pregnant. Are you sure? How do you know? I asked you a question. What are your people doing? Why are you taking children? What happens to pregnant women on this island? What happens? They die. To Maybe we should just pull it out. <laughs> I mean, just make it worse. You forgot what's at stake here. It's just another one of your flashes. Who's getting an arrow in the neck this time? Unless you forget, she said my bloody name. You're alive. Again! 
guy who shot Saeed. Kate told us he lived out in that station. Lock blew up. He's in other. I thought Lock killed that guy with the electro fence thingy. I used to make stuff. Store it, though. I was a Soviet Army field medic. I can offer you my services. Wait, what are you doing? I'm saving up. If I fix her, you must let me walk away as if I never came upon you. What you need? Poor son. She didn't even want the baby, and now she is. She's gonna die. Or at least that's what she thinks. Well, Well, Kuno you want me to help you and your baby? I have answers to your questions, but you have to come with me right now. Just you and me, nobody else. If what you said was true, that means I'm already dead. Why should I go anywhere with you? Because there may be hope for you yet. I'm gonna look at your baby and determine the DOC. The ultrasound will tell me when you got pregnant, give or take a day. If you got pregnant off the island, then you and your baby will probably be okay. But if you got pregnant here, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. She's afraid that the baby is not uh, with Jim. Malali. Money. Money. I 공장장 이런 그만두고 이제부터 내가 시키는 일만 하게 될 거다. What else do you know about this woman? Did she have anything on her besides the flare gun? Just a book, fancy radio phone thingy. Why? What? Does it work? Like I tell you. Steady. I, I heard you. <laughs> Is that normal? What did she say? Thank you. She said thank you for helping me. Did she? Why are you doing this? What? Helping me. Once upon a time, I told women that they were pregnant and their faces was the best news they ever got in their entire life. And I came here. I've lost nine patients in the last three years. I'm helping you because I want to tell you that you and your husband got pregnant before you came here. Well, hopefully not. I slept with another man. Oh, before we got to the island. Oh. oh, 
important things from Claire's room. She should be better in a day. A day? A long was punctured. On this island, the rules are a bit different. Maybe a day and a half. So why wasn't Boone healed then? Maybe he was supposed to die? I'll seriously be considering letting him Just go. Just go. We've got to make a stretcher and carry her. How are we going to do that and bring a prisoner? I need some rope. I'll take responsibility. Took the phone. Hold. Uh, Jen, hold. Jen, it's all right. No, lay him, Jen. Jen. Let him go. Jen, let him go. Phone. He tried to have a baby back in Korea and couldn't. And the doctor told me Jin was infertile. And then you came here. Did you know? That the average male sperm count is between 60 and 80 million. But on this island, it's five times that. We call that good odds. Why would the island make them extra fertile by then killing the baby? This is not a it's a gift. I don't understand. There's your baby. You see? I can see it. <laughs> you crashed here 90 days ago. The baby was conceived about eight weeks ago. So you're on 53 days. You're gonna die. Woo! Got pregnant on the island. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, son. I will do everything that I can. No, I think she's happy. It's just... She's a showman, you know, with my smart child, she's so... I said it. I didn't say it. Correct. I'm going to die with my husband. I'm going to die with you. I don't have to die with you. I'm not going to die with you. So how long do I have? Most of the women made it into the middle of their second trimester. Nobody made it to their third. That gives me... Two months. You gave me good news, Julian. I'm gonna go back inside and make sure that I didn't miss anything. I don't want to take the chance that we didn't cover our tracks. Is she gonna tell Ben? Quan is pregnant. The fetus is healthy and was conceived on island with her husband. He was sterile before they got here. I'm still working on getting samples from the other women. I should have Austin's soon. I hate you. Who are you? You Gorillas. I crashed here on Oceanic Flight 815. A bunch of us survived. Is that why you're here? Were you looking for us? That's not possible. Yeah, I know. It wasn't easy, but we found food. No. And the hatch. No, more Flight food. 815. They. They found the plane. There were no survivors. They were all dead. What? What does she mean they found the plane? I'm confused. So that was a thing. Thing. Um, I don't know what to think about that ending part. Um, okay, let's start with the beginning. This episode was about Sun and a bit about Jin, uh, but mostly about Sun. A mysterious woman approach her asking Sun about um, herself, but mostly about Jin. If 
she knows his parents and when son said that you know they're dead the mysterious woman revealed that uh, it's not actually they're not actually dead that he's the son of a fisherman father was a prostitute and if son doesn't want this news to come out she has to give some monies, be money because uh, she managed to find uh, Jin's father she went to visit him and I I, f I don't know I feel bad for, for his father but also for Jin I feel bad for his father because he also kept or is still keeping a secret from Jin. Um, he told Jin that his mother is dead to spare him the you know, embarrassment to find out that um, her mother, his mother, abandoned him, and you know she was a prostitute, or you know I don't know if like she was doing this as a job. Or she was just, you know, um, sleeping around. I mean, that's not imp the important part. The important part is that she she left uh, her son to as a baby. I didn't care about about him. But at the same time, I feel kind of bad for Jean that. She uh, he f felt the need to lie about his father um, because he thought you know his his father is not I don't know worthy enough or he doesn't have a I don't know a more important job I, I don't know it's I feel bad that he felt embarrassed that's that's what it, it is because you know his father is not like he has he's a fisherman it's an honest job making honest money so uh, I, I don't think it should matter and after all our family or our parents doesn't represent ourselves so who cares I mean I, I kind of get it because he wanted like this well-paid job and he feared that they're gonna um, reject him just because his father is not this wealthy man um well he she had a discussion with jean's father and they agreed not to tell jean that she was there and especially that she knows about uh, his mother and because of that she asked money from from her father course he realized that it was because of Jin and I don't think it was because of the from the uh, he was such a good man to help uh, his daughter but because you know the if something bad comes out about Jin it will reflect on him so you know uh, but I am guessing at that point Jin started working for uh, son's father like working working um, and it's it's a funny thing because all this time Jin kind of blamed Sun for what he has to do because you know it was because of you that I work for your father because you know your father is this and that and he makes me do this and that and you know this is the price I have to pay to be with you when all this time, it was Sun that was trying to protect Jin from finding the truth. 
the only way she could is you know ask money from her father and at the end it was revealed that this mysterious woman was Jin's father all along so no uh, mother sorry uh, all along so yay for great parents um, but on the island Sun found out about um, Juliet and what she does and about the women that get pregnant on the island and uh, Juliet um, agreed to help her in a way or another and uh, because um, you know she was afraid that she son is gonna have the same fate as all the other women and they went to that station the medical station uh, because like I was kind of right that Claire was okay because she came to the island already pregnant she didn't got pregnant on the island and um, that's what Julia said that son is gonna be okay if the conception didn't happen on the island but you know before uh, now you know of course son cared about that you know am I gonna die or not but I think she was more her biggest problem was that the child wasn't Jean's uh, she lived with this guilt and uh, surprise the baby is with Jin so yay I don't think I think they're gonna find something um, like a cure or something I don't think son is gonna die uh, because of the pregnancy well, we're gonna see and um, so Juliet still keeps in touch with Ben I mean not a surprise because that uh, that's her purpose there um, being with the survivors is to keep an eye on on Claire and now on Sun and she left a message to Ben telling him that um, Sun is pregnant and she'll keep an eye on on her uh, but also she'll take um, samples from all the women and apparently Kate is next I don't think that means Kate is pregnant I'm pretty sure it's not what it meant um, but it just in case you know <laughs> so cool also um, the the woman there that fell from the sky, I mean from the airplane, not airplane, helicopter woke up but she was pretty injured somehow Michael, not Michael, somehow Mikhail survived um, so the, the flare came there and he offered his help in exchange to for them to let him go he did try to take the the satellite phone but you know he got caught so that's that um that, but <laughs> That's not the most important thing. The most important thing is what um, the woman said that it's impossible for them to be the survivors of the plane because the plane was found and there were no survivors. Now... What if it has something to do with the others? 
and it was just a, a news that came up on TV, on radio, whatever that they heard and the plane wasn't actually found. It was just um, um, a distraction or, I mean, a lie so that uh, they'll stop looking for for the survivors and they won't uh, manage to find the island because I'm guessing they don't want to be found. So they just put this fake news out there so people will stop. You know, we find the plane, no survivors. And if it's true, I don't know. Like no one wanted the, the bodies? Like I guess it no. Hmm. Maybe they said that it fell into the ocean and the bodies couldn't be recovered. Like, I don't... I don't know. But I, I feel it's a lie. Because, sure, in the beginning, I thought that maybe they are dead and this is just on, like, a collective purgatory and, you know, with all the flashbacks and all that stuff. But now... For some time now, I don't believe that anymore. I think, you know, they are alive and somehow they really managed to survive. Um, I know the island is, like, magical. But... Um, like, the wreckage, the plane is still on the island. So... <laughs> It's impossible for it to be to be found. So yeah, I don't believe it. Uh, but it was took me by surprise, honestly. But I don't believe it. I think it has something to do with the others not wanting people to come to the island and or to wanting them to stop looking for the survivors. So yeah. Um, also, I've been thinking, but I think I forgot to to talk about it. Uh, I, I've been thinking about um, the others, Jacob and the Black Smoke. Um, I think I said it that maybe Jacob is the Black Smoke. But now if I like if I think about it I don't think Jacob is the black smoke. Whoever Jacob is and whatever the black smoke is, I don't think it's the same person. Because um Ben kept uh, keeps saying his name. Also in the video, in the video, in the episode with Juliet, when she she wanted to go back to Rachel because Rachel was uh, sick again, Ben said that Jacob will uh, cure Rachel. But at the same time, the place where they were staying. Um, had or has the that defense mechanism that keeps the black smoke away. Why would the others uh, have that fence uh, working? Why would they, you know, protecting themselves with that fence from the black smoke if Jacob, which I at the time I presume was the black smoke, is helping them. Like he is willing to help the others with, you know, cure uh, Rachel. So um, Juliet will, you know, continue with her research and and um, 
Ben has apparently faith in him and, and Juliet should have faith in in Jacob and then with the when uh, Kate Sawyer and Alex were trying to uh, save um, Alex's boyfriend there on that screen was you know Jacob's name again so apparently Jacob is really important for the others so I don't think Jacob is the black smoke like again why would others uh, try to protect themselves from the black smoke so for them the black smoke is a, a danger something to be afraid of so I don't think it's Jacob I still believe was the black smoke that made um, what is called John stop entering the numbers and you know make the hatch explode to hurt the island but I don't think Jacob is the black smoke anymore so that's that <laughs> well that was an interesting episode I enjoyed it uh, can't wait for the next anyway I think this is all I have to say about this episode thank you for watching I hope you enjoy and I will see you next time. Bye!